expressing yourself is so important because one it highlights what you need to work on what we've highlighted it once we do examine it and look at it closely it highlights what you need to work on um, and also i told you about didn't i about when i was playing football I'd hide hide some of my gifts so i wouldn't want to express the gifts because of the what people might think and i suppose that is a, a thing about expressing feelings and um now more than ever i'm not i'm not shy anymore i'm just saying that this is and what i think su- i'm built suppressed footballer champion tennis player you're like the super athlete of the group aren't you no no super athletes here i i, I have to add uh, <laughs> um but I, but that, that's the thing you know I think people do have gifts, and I think some people can cover them up, and they shouldn't. Absolutely not. And of course, as I said we last week, there's a difference between arrogance and confidence and arrogance. We still have to be careful 100%. on that line. But you do need confidence and things like that to to excel. There's no doubt about it. Without the confidence, you just won't you won't fulfil the gifts that you have. And no. you, you do need that. And and you look at great people, and they do express themselves, express their things. In fact, Novak Djokovic, he won the um, French, French Open. Open. That's thank you. I was just <laughs> Like, come to me in time. Thank you so much, Ryan. Uh, and he was he was talking about, and he was expressing his feelings, you know, to the crowd after he won his twenty third Grand Slam, which is an absolute record. And he was talking about, you know, real be It was really inspiring. Actually, I wish I'd recorded it and made a video of it because it is really cool. I expect someone had done that already. But that is the pinnacle of anything of expressing feelings. And but also, just to give a, a tip of the hat to you, Lee. He was talking about the present moment and being in the moment and just enjoying. Okay.